Also developing tonight, a Central Florida man frightened to see a burglar trying to break into his home takes action and grabs a gun and shoots at the intruder. So tonight, the burglar is in jail. It happened in Winter Springs on Lisa Loop. That's a small street with about maybe two dozen homes. That's where we find New 6 investigator Mike DeForest for us tonight. Mike, police say this burglar hit several other homes in that area, right? Matt, the way the investigators describe it, it sounds like this guy was basically going door to door, breaking into cars, trying to get into homes. But the last place he visited sent this burglar scurrying for safety. 911, do you need police, fire, and medical? Hey, hey, I think there's someone trying to break into my house. Surveillance cameras capture a burglar sneaking into the screened enclosure of a Winter Springs home. Little did he know, the homeowner was inside watching and reaching for his gun. They were wearing a hooded, a, a hoodie. Black and there was a flashlight on my back, uh, in my back porch. And I shot through my back window. Winter Springs police believe 17-year-old Alexander Yangus drove a stolen car to the neighborhood. Investigators say he then burglarized at least three vehicles and tried to get into at least one other home before he snuck into this yard. Surveillance video shows the burglar running for his life as the homeowner opens fire. Yangus escaped without being shot, say police, but authorities soon found him walking around the neighborhood wearing a soccer jacket that he allegedly stole from one of the cars. Now that vehicle that police found out here that they believe uh, the burglar used to get to this neighborhood had been reported stolen out of Longwood earlier this morning. Uh, tonight, th that guy is in jail facing a slew of charges, including grand theft auto, burglary, and prowling. Reporting live in Winter Springs, Mike DeForest, News 6. All right, Mike, thank you.